Hey guys, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. I am c cat and the Empire of Britannia is still growing. Yes, that's right, we have taken over some more of Scandinavia area, and it's looking good. We're taking over Iceland right now, and uh, we just finished fighting for a little part of whatever the heck was over here. You know what, I'm not even sure what this part is called anymore, but we took it over, and we're going to keep taking it over until, frankly, it doesn't matter anymore. So, that's always a good start to an episode, I feel. Oh. Talking of good starts, we've got a victory. Just a random victory. People are trying to kill people. What else is new in the Empire of Britannia? There's a lot of messages now that I've just reached that size which messages don't even matter. They're just like, oh, we've got a problem, my lord. And I'm like, oh, really? Yeah, we've got some peasants. Oh, really? What are the peasants doing? I don't know, my lord. They're just being peasanty. Oh, great. Thanks for wasting my time, asshole. You know, that's just a lot of conversations I'm having with my, uh, you know, my underlings. It's just I don't care about anything they've got to say. Uh, we haven't looked at technology lately. Oh, we could probably increase majesty. That'll give me some more uh, prestige. It'll give me more percentage. So, 15.75 to... Bam. 15.75. Okay, that's not right. It'll probably clear at the end of the month. Uh, let's see. It'll be there in a second. Uh, 15.75... 16.59! Eh, it's an extra point of prestige a month. Not a lot. Oh! Uh, Iceland... ...just... ...shat itself. What happened, Iceland? Okay, my cause belly failed. That's fine. And we can't be bothered getting those men back. These men can disband. Okay, so Iceland just shat itself. Uh, it's kind of annoying, but oh well. Sometimes Iceland shits itself. And there's not, not much you can do about it. Why would you want to? I mean, that's pretty much what happened recently, if I remember rightly. Just Iceland just had enough. Uh, we can create a new duchy, I suppose, and give it to... No one. You know, I'm not going to create a duchy then, if that's the, what we're doing. King Fergus. Are you a new king? Are you a new... Yes, you used to be King Jeff, and then King Jeff died, I suppose. Oh well. Uh, King Jeff, we had a good battle. Do you remember those days, King Jeff? They were good times. We fought well. We fought against each other, yes, but we fought valiantly, violently, and all those other words that end with L-Y at the end of it. So, what did King Jeff die of anyway? I'm kind of intrigued now. History, how did you die, King Jeff? Natural death at 70. I guess Magnus is getting on as well. I mean, a lot of my people are quite old. Um, this guy has got a lot of children. That's good, I suppose. I mean, people are being murdered, apparently, at the age of nine. Was that before this guy was born? Uh, 13th of April, 1349. This guy was born th I don't know why they murdered the little girl. Why did you murder the little girl? You'd be better off murdering the son, but no, they just murdered the little girl. Oh, okay. Just... Just change your pace, I suppose. Um... But yeah, Britannia taking over most of Scandinavia now. I mean, we might even... I wonder what we need to claim... Create Scandinavia. We need... Oh, okay, no, we need 80% of it and we've only got 30% of it. It looks like we've got a lot of it. But I guess a lot of Scandinavia is in these tiny little provinces in here. And also Iceland. And also these islands. So yeah, okay. It looks like we've got a lot more than we actually do. Uh, how is this Rome-Byzantine war going? Uh, oh. No, Holy Roman Empire is still winning it. Who is actually on the other side of this war? I don't even know. Ah, uh, you're asking for more suitable little situation, living situation? No, you're going to the Ablet. Always the Ablet. It's where you belong. I just imagine I'm just throwing them down upon the same person over and over. Ah, uh, you want to duel your rival? I'm pretty sure we've already done that, but you can do it again. Just keep dueling your rivals. I don't particularly care. Ah, uh, who's in jail? You are... Why are you even in jail? I don't know, but I was the one that put you in there. And you're not happy about it? No, absolutely not. I'm not letting him go. Jihad for Egypt fails. Cool. 
Uh, how's Genoa going? Are they in the middle of a civil war or anything? They are. Uh, I'd, I'd always like to make a attack on Genoa, but I just don't feel it would go very well. Just a little one. Just a little war on Genoa. Just, you know, see how it feels. Uh, we can do an embargo on them, but... We get a lot of money. That's about all we would get. Um, but... A whole bunch of de jure claims. There's a duchy we can claim for. That's not even a very good duchy. It's two counties. It's not very good at all, actually. Uh, who was... Not my heir. No, it was, uh... Now I remember. It was... Prince Solaire... Is engaged to her. And she is the one who is in a really good state. So what I might do... No, I really need her to have reached the age of 16 first. And there's no one I can uh, betroth her to, is there? I've tried to do this already, I think. I'll try again. This guy, no, no they're definitely not going to allow that. I imagine we're going to get to a point where we try to betroth them to... Uh, what's your name? To Solaire, and they're just going to be like, no, and just going to deny it. I wouldn't be surprised if that happened, actually. I'd hope it wouldn't, but it may just well happen. Uh, who are you trying to get out? This guy? Did I throw him in there? He stays there. Who are you? You're of Croatia? You know what? You can join him. Congratulations, now you're in jail. Now don't you just feel silly being in jail like that. You look like a fool. I'll allow the duel, because I always do. Uh, Castile is probably still ruled by the same man. It is. But I still say, the second that this guy dies, I'm going to see if I can claim Castile. Oh, well, that's Brittany. No, it's not Brittany. It just looks like it's part of Brittany. Well, it is Brittany, like, historically, but it is actually not Brittany. You know what? Let's go up to speed four. There's not much I really want to do just yet. And we can just sit, sort of sit here and just... I want to make a claim for Gotland, but I just feel like... Oh, wow, Gotland's actually fairly strong and money-wise. Uh, my family has not really expanded beyond what I knew they had, which is just this area here. I was kind of hoping maybe it had expanded beyond that, but it has not. Uh, let's see, empires, no, nothing really interesting there. Kingdoms. I still like how England is just half of France. But, still nothing really of note. Culture, I mean... Irish culture is spread a little bit beyond over this way, but it's just not really, you know, cultures aren't too surprising, aside from this whole Mongol culture over here, everything in culture makes pretty much sense. The weirdest thing I think in this game is still what's happened with religion. I mean, religion has, uh, you know, kind of gone everywhere. Religion's become a mess. Look at it. I mean... Orthodox is usually over here, but they've just become Catholic. Probably this is why the whole uh, Roman Empire and uh, Holy Roman Empire, the Holy Roman Empire and Byzantine being the same thing, it's probably where that started. Uh, Holy Roman Empire is having a little bit of a problem with the civil war. In fact, I wonder if I can uh, get in on that. It's probably a bad way of thinking. Let's see what I can do. Uh, Lyon. I could try for that. You know what? If it's not a duchy, at least a duchy, I'm not interested. That is technically a duchy, yes, but... Actually, that's not a bad duchy to go for. Who are you involved in? Why are you even... Why have I not attacked you yet? You know what? I'm going to attack you. I don't even care. Uh, and... No one is of my house, so it doesn't really matter so much. So, yeah, okay. That's one war that we can have going. Genoa, I, uh, yeah, I don't... Actually, hang on, was that someone who had a... 
claim on Lithuania? Maybe not. Uh, I've got a duchy here for this place. Oh, that's... No, it's probably not the best idea. Uh, Mecklenburg. Yeah, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere as well. But again, you know what, let's just focus on this war that I've started here. See what we can do with this, and then if... You know, if this goes well, then perhaps we'll uh, look at another war. Yeah, I think that's historically what you do. You know, you don't start a million wars at the same time, you just sort of do what you can for a little while and then you go to the next one. Oh, is he a heretic? You keep saying that, but he's not a heretic. I'm sure he's not a heretic. You tell me. Are you a heretic? N no, I don't know what you're talking about. Are you sure? Because, I mean, you know, I'm seeing some of those red crosses and we're all about the yellow crosses over here. Because yellow is the way of Jesus. Jesus Christ! Okay, so... Emperor Magnus I has passed over to heaven at age 52. He died a maimed cripple. How did he die a maimed cripple? When did you get maimed? Who maimed you? I don't know how you got maimed. Were you always maimed? Oh wait, you were always maimed, weren't you? I remember that now. Yes, okay, so you did die a maimed cripple. But you didn't die because you're a maimed cripple. You died... Okay, whatever. That, that's actually okay. Uh, anyway. Long live Emperor... Ualta... Ualta? Walter? Walter? I don't know. All hail this new emperor. Woo! And... Okay. He's also a mass and wealth. Good job. So... We are now this guy. <laughs> it sounds like... If you've ever seen Homestuck, you are now this guy. That's kind of what's just happened. I am now this guy. Uh, I am a drunkard. I am slothful. I am arbitrary. And I have other good traits as well. Uh, content. Just honest. At least I'm honest about my drunkenness. That's appreciative, I suppose. And sure enough, we've got a peasant revolt. That's the first thing we have to deal with. Where are these peasants? Where are you? Oh, they're over in France, just fighting people. Well, actually, it's not France, is it? It's part of England. So, they're over in England. Fr French England. France England. I don't know what I call this. Best England. No, it's... What am I saying? Best England. It's part of France. France England is not best England. England England is best England. Or something. <laughs> I don't know. That one got away from me a bit. That's like one of my favourite phrases, saying something got away from me a bit. But things always get away from me because I let them. Uh, okay, they're coming around. And... You know, everyone can meet up here. I still feel like I'm missing someone though. I'm missing you. You're in combat, you're on the boats, you're on the boats. Okay, I'm not really missing anyone at all, I just felt like I was, okay. That's alright, as long as I'm not actually missing anyone. Um, we are probably going to have some civil war problems very soon, so I may have to look into that as well. In fact, let's look at that now. Factions. Prince Sean for Britannia, I don't think so. That's really not happening. Um, actually, could I... I could kill my brother, but it's not really a thing I want to do. I can hold a grand tournament. I, would oh, I need to not be at war, though. That's an important thing. I need a bit more prestige. Well, prestige will come fairly quickly because, you know, being an emperor is pretty prestigious. And so, King Solaire the Second. Of England. That's pretty cool. I like how he's the second. That's... I like that a lot, actually. And as soon as his wife is, uh, 16, they shall marry, hopefully. 
And then we'll see if we can start murdering people. Maybe we can start murdering people now. Maybe people like this guy better than they like the last guy. Uh, okay, so you are the father and heir to Castile. So I want to kill you. You are the one I want to die. Uh, before we start adding plots everywhere. Now people kind of like you. We may have to wait for this. You feel like you should be given... Oh, wait, actually... My oh! How do I have a sky of learning zero as my... Yeah, look. Sure. Okay, so... Uchar the Fat is not very good at choosing who his... Council... In fact, you know, you've just gone to someone three. It's We're redoing this, clearly. It clearly needs to be redone, because this guy has no idea what he's doing. Uh, 21, sure. Actually, we're going to give this guy a title, an honorary title. We're going to give him Senchal. It's probably the best. Build Spy Network, yes, because we want to know if anything goes wrong. Actually, we want a scheme, didn't we? Oh well, too bad, we've done it the wrong way now. Uh, we want to research... Researching... And Chancellor, we want you to be well liked. In fact, what we need to do is we need to. Where are you? I wonder if I can go Chancelloring myself and get him to get him to like himself more. I suppose I could put him anywhere and he'll. No, that doesn't make any sense. I've just realised. Oh well, that's what I've done now. Doesn't matter if it makes sense. Okay, so we've occupied a little bit of land. No, we haven't. Why does it say we have then? Navarra. Are these guys mine? Aragorn. Oh, Aragorn is my men. <laughs> I totally didn't know. Uh, I was like, how do we occupy something when I haven't occupied it? Because they're my men, and my men are good at what they do. Which is being the best soldiers in the world. They're pretty good at being the best soldiers in the world. Alright, let's go fight against those rebels. We're two to, well, we're 2,000 men below them, so... That might be bad. We, maybe we shouldn't do this. In fact, maybe we shouldn't. That's... We're being too hasty. And you never get anywhere by being too hasty. I learned that in a song once. It's a good song, too. It's about a guy who was... I think it was like Right Seed Freight or something, I don't know. It amused me, it was, a, it was a silly song. About a guy who was trying to... fix a building or something, and he ends up just taking the building down by mistake, because he's shit at his job. That'd be the worst contract, you know. Hey, could you just uh, help us build this building? Yeah, sure. Oh, I broke it. I wouldn't pay that guy. You know, you just, you shouldn't pay someone who breaks your building. Holy Roman Empire. This war has been going on for a while. In fact, let's check the ledger on this one. Uh, possible inheritances. Nothing too exciting there. Uh, wars, okay. So it's about 50%, we'll try and find it that way. Uh, this is the one here. It's been going since 1343. So it's been going for almost 20 years now. That's an impressive war. It's actually very impressive. I'm impressed by your wars, Saz! Uh, impressed indeed. Uh, do we have any factions I should be worried about just yet? No, none of them above 10% of liege. Okay, now we've got more men than they do. That's probably a safer way to fight them now. And I think I was just excommunicated again. I was. <sighs> I'm always getting excommunicated. That's fine, though. I mean, I'm kind of expecting that I'll just always be excommunicated. And where are they off to? This place? Alright, I'll chase them down. I really feel like Britannia can't fall now. 
But of course, if someone has a claim to Britannia, which I think the King of Jerusalem does have a potential to do that. But when they do, if they do that, then that's where I have a problem. But even if they get the Empire of Britannia, all they do is get the Empire. They don't actually win everything. I really like this model's hair. I like, I like the little braid here. It's quite cute, I feel. That's just me talking, though. Uh, educate. We'll have her educated in the ways of... Uh, diplomacy. Yeah, she needs to understand diplomacy. Because, you know, girl. Sexism. That's how it is, right? Uh, and this should... End... Oh, my other wars ended as well, somehow. Darn it. Cause of Spelly aimed it again. Just, I'm constantly losing Cause of Spelly. <laughs> ah, so annoying. Why do they keep taking Cause of Spelly away from me? <laughs> oh well. May the humors rot in your spine. It's not what they say. They could though. I don't even remember what the humors are. Probably not a thing you want to be rotting in your spine, though. I think as a general rule, you never want anything to be rotting in your spine. Uh, I think it's a bad thing to happen. Why were you? Go why was Aragon fighting? Aragon? I don't know why they were fighting, but all I can tell you is they didn't succeed in whatever they were fighting for. Uh, you're not Castle Shipyard. Sure, we're going to spend some money now, just because we can. Uh, barracks, yep. Or, as they call them in Dota 2, apparently they call them Racks. Uh, I guess for the same reason that in League of Legends we call them Inhibs. Because it's faster to say, kill the Racks, than, you know, kill the Barracks. You know, Barracks is not that hard a thing to say. Maybe it's just me talking here. And I do talk a lot, I know. But, come on. Barracks? Racks? It's not that hard to say. Uh, I've almost got enough money for the new grand... Well, new, enough prestige for the next tournament. In fact, there we go. Oh, and now it actually tells us. Hold a grand tournament. Yes. Yay, grand tournament. This is my favorite part. How many people will die inadvertently today? So many. So many will die today. You know, people are just trying to, like, kill people, and I'm okay with that. Holy crap, wait, is this guy being in jail for 43 years? Wait, this person went to jail at the age of... 40, 57 minus 43 is 13. They've been in jail for most of their life. That's pretty sad. I might even let them go. Yeah, no. How many people do I even have in my jail? Wait, let's check that again. I have 18 prisoners. 44 years. Oh, the same person. 28 years. A few uh, a few of my uh, house in there. Oh no, my houseman has been injured in the tournament. He has been maimed. Alright. And this random guy has been killed. But he's from Castile, I think. He's not from Castile, he's from, like, Galicia. Uh, most unfortunate. <laughs> Just a man from Galicia to, not Galicia. I don't know. Uh, who won? You did! Abdul Abad. Abad Abadid. Abad Abadid? You know what? Not trying to be racist here, but I think it's what his name is. From the Duchy of Valois. Uh, the Pope wants me to change. Nope. Uh, Ronald Duncal of Galloway is second in the tournament. Good work. And Arne Bronjovsk, son of Hajenskenland, is third. So we got someone from Galloway. Uh, Galicia, 
from Scotland and from Norway. That was a pretty multiracial tournament. Like the winners. I'm pretty happy with that. And then everyone likes me 10 more for two years. And that, my friends, will be the end of today's episode. So thank you for joining me in the Grand Tournament and the constant failed causes belly. <laughs> One day that won't happen. Until then, join me next episode, which will be Friday, assuming I don't miss it again. And I'll see you then. Bye! Meow.